what the? Huh? Blinky lights. We got blinky lights. Let's go. So this is the Nano Leaf Ultra Black Limited Edition Triangle Starter Pack. I got this from Amazon, includes nine panels compatible with Alexa, Google Home Assistant, Apple HomeKit and more. It's currently priced at $179.99 in the UK at the time of recording. It also has 4.5 star rating out of 56 reviews. Let's take a closer look and see what's in the box. We're greeted with a card containing QR codes and shape ideas. We also have a multilingual quick start guide. We have nine of these ultra black triangles. We've got loads of these sticky tabs. They even include a free sticker. Nine of these double ended connectors. We've got one of these controllers. This is really convenient because it can connect anywhere around your light design. I'll show you later in the video. We also get the EU and the UK socket connector and the power adapter. The power adapter is also convenient because this can connect anywhere around the light. And it's nice to see they included the EU and the UK socket there, obviously intending on lighting up the world with that kind of behavior. The panels are around 8 inches in length and have 6 connection points on each triangle. They're around 1 centimeter thick so they'll sit around a centimeter from the wall. These connectors are very convenient. They allow you to place the controller or the power supply on any of the connection points on any of the triangles. I'm going to quickly make a shape here just for a demonstration but as you can see the controller slicks on like so. Stick the panels on like so and that's it. You're good to go. In regards to mounting, we've got several options. You've got these loops on the back. They rotate 360 degrees and you can just put a screw or a mount or a hook in the wall and hang them that way. You can also stick the sticky pads onto the back of these. These sticky pads are quite strong and if you use all of them, they will certainly hold the panels up wherever you put them. Don't use this sticker though. Use this one on the cat or on your door or something. Once you've figured out your shapes and connected the controller, it'll take around 30 seconds to sync up with the light panels. You want to go ahead and install the Nanoleaf application. You can do this by scanning the QR code included it in the box or go to the Google and Apple stores and search for it. You'll have a few permissions to go through, go through those and then you want to click add device. There's several ways to connect. Firstly, you can scan the QR code on the back of your controller. If you fail to connect via that method, you can also select the manual method where you enter the code. The code can be found on the other side of the controller. Once you have completed setup, you now have full control of your nano leaves. Basic functions include power on, power off, brightness, etc. I'll just quickly show you the brightness. This is with the brightness down to zero. This is at around 25%. I did notice when it's at like 25 to 50%, you can see some slight hotspots. As soon as you get around 75% to 100%, those hotspots disappear. The color wheel is very, very vibrant. Look at those reds. Look how deep those colors are, guys. That is fantastic. I don't think I've ever seen any RGB as vibrant as that. That is incredible. The reds and the blues especially. The app is very responsive. Almost instantly as soon as I move to a color, the panels receive that color and display it almost immediately. And yeah, the colors are really deep and vibrant. They're amazing. If we click on the scenes tab, we can come and select any of the presets that's already loaded for us. There's a mixture of cycle and rhythm modes. There's far too many to go through them all, but I'll show you some of the ones that I think look really cool. These are also customizable. So if you're not keen on the colors, you can swipe each of these to the left. This will bring up a little secret menu with a pen tool and a color wheel, things like that. You can then heart and save that as a favorite. You can also add and download some from the app. This COPS one here is one that I downloaded from the Nanoleaf app. And not only do they do a fantastic job of displaying the bright and vibrant colors, but they also do a fantastic job at displaying the pastel colors. That means that these lighting panels are more than suitable for any gaming streaming setup or even grandma's hallway. 
like I said, there's far too many to go through them all, so we'll move on to some of the cool features. Another awesome feature here is the magic word. You can type a whole host of words and phrases and the panel will display an idea to you. You can then decide to save or try something else. I just did red and green to test this. Once you've saved them, they'll be available in your scenes list. I think that's a pretty cool feature. Another cool feature is the touch and gesture control. This is incredible guys. It's not 100% accurate, but I'll show you guys now. Okay, so this is quite responsive and impressive, but there are one or two issues. You do have to sometimes repeat the gesture. You can customize the gestures in the application. So for example, upwards to turn them off, down to turn them on, left to change the color, right to change the mode. Overall, very responsive and real good fun to use. Like I said, you do sometimes have to repeat the gesture, but other than that, really good fun to use and i am glad the feature exists they're also really smart you could play mini games and stuff like this if you hold down your hand on any of the panels you can see that panel illuminates so that's another cool feature you could play little mini games and things like that as long as your panel securely connected to the wall if we come back to the application for a second, you can also choose the orientation of your panel and you can select where your controller is. Like I said, it can go anywhere around the panel really. And if we come back onto the scenes for a moment, you can customize these by going onto finger paint or dynamic. You'll be given a color wheel and you can also change the RGB and you can also change the warmth of those colors. Like I said, you can customize each of the individual presets by pulling the slider to the left, which pulls up your color wheel and edit tools. Then we have the motion tab. This is cool. We can again select colors, but we have a rhythm and an interactive tab. Now, if we click the interactive tab, this allows us to download some more themes from the Nano app. There's a few here, Meteor Shower, Colourful Zebra, Game of Life, Checkerboard, Lightning, Firecrackers, Ripple, Dancing Duo, Northern Lights, etc. There's so many to choose from. Right now, we're going to go with Meteor Shower. Click Download. This then should be in our Rhythm section. So, it is. Let's click on Meteor Shower then and see what it looks like. So yeah, it's just another lighting mode basically, but you can play with these and tweak these and customize them to match your setup or to your taste. If you guys want to see a complete guide on how to use the application and customize everything in depth, then let's try and get this video to 200 likes. I have to say overall, I'm very impressed with these. I really enjoy them. I'm going to keep them out and use them daily at the moment. I'll keep them in my setup so you guys might see them in the background quite often. I'll leave links down in the description. I am an Amazon affiliate so I do receive a small percentage of any sales those links generate but I'm not linked to or sponsored by Nanoleaf in any way this is just my personal opinion guys I'm gonna leave you with some footage of these lights in action now but if you found any part of this video helpful or if you enjoyed any part of it or just enjoy supporting small creators like me please consider leaving a like on the video subscribing to the channel with your notifications on that way you never miss any future uploads thanks to each and every one of you for being here I appreciate all of you guys until next time, take care of yourself and each other. I'm Craig, this is Really Random Reviews, and I'll see you guys in the next video.